Hi, my name is Dr. Dan Perez. Thank you for tuning in to this YouTube video. Today I'm going to talk about the 5 LED torch light emitting diode that uses red, infrared, and blue light. It's got a lot of applications that I'll go over with you in this video. In case this is the first time you've visited one of my videos, I regularly post content on self-managing musculoskeletal pain and dysfunction. Things like low back pain, neck pain, joint pain, arthritis. You know, your musculoskeletal system is the vessel that takes you around in this world. And it plays a great role on how satisfying your life will be. If you're physically encumbered and are unable to do the things that you really want to do, then it's my hope that I could provide information to help you overcome these limitations. So the contents of this box, let me open it here. <clears throat> okay, it includes a set of instructions. It's got protective eyewear. It's got two batteries. There's one that's inside the device. The device itself, it's got this probe, and I'll show you what this is for. And it's got a battery charger. Okay, so the five LEDs include one 630 and one 660 nanometer wavelength. That's nanometer is one billionth of a meter wavelength therapeutic red light. Now this is the wavelength that the studies show has therapeutic benefit to cells. Namely, it increases their energy and their respiratory rate. And when you can do that, uh, sick or injured cells can carry out their functions more efficiently, which would include exchanging oxygen and carbon dioxide and waste products. And it also increases their ATP production. ATP is the energy molecule that cells need to do things such as synthesize proteins. Okay, so that was 630 and 660. There's also an 850 and 940 nanometer wavelength, a little longer. Infrared light, so these two are not visible. The LEDs will not show red, but they emanate uh, infrared heat. The infrared wavelength is, is longer, so it penetrates deeper. You combine that with the 660 and 630 that does the photobiomodulation. The infrared uh, wavelengths go in there and they warm up the area that causes vasodilation of the blood vessel, vessel, so you get more circulation. More circulation equals more oxygen delivery. And the fifth LED is 460 nanometers, which is shorter, and it appears blue. That blue wavelength is known for being bactericidal. The blue light will be appropriate for like open wounds. There's some dermatological conditions where you have a bacteria that contribute to like a rash, a reaction. You could use the blue light to disinfect that area. When you press the button once, it turns on all the LEDs. You press it a second time, and it's just the red and infrared. This mode right here is what you want to use for straight out pain reduction and wound healing. And press it a third time, the red turns off, and it's just the blue. And this would be the setting you would use if you wanted to clear up some of the bacteria in a wound. Here's a closer view of the instrument. You can see it's, it's uh, metal, very durable construction. Those are the five LEDs. I'll go on ahead and turn them on, so uh, just kind of look away for a second. Okay, that's all five. These are the red and infrared, and that's the blue. If you hold the button down for a couple of seconds, you'll get it in pulse mode. Subsequent impressions of the button will put you through the same cycle, so this would be all red and infrared, and this is pulse blue mode. Now what is pulse for? Well, that helps reduce what's called accommodation, but either one is fine, pulsed or continuous. I'll screw this probe here. Now this probe allows you to access narrow passageways. If you have ear pain, the red light will get all the way to your tympanic membrane or your eardrum, and even past that to stimulate your middle ear, that's your cochlea. And the other area would be your nose, so your nasal area. If you're congested, it means your sinuses are swollen. So put it on red, 
and put it up your nose and just bathe those sinuses and that'll clear up your passageways. If you have tooth pain or gum pain, you could stick this in your mouth and uh, apply the red light to that area. You could concentrate the red light over your supraorbital area. This can sometimes help with ocular pain, like pressure behind the eyes. Now this is a great therapeutic tool to have at home. You could take it with you to work or for travel. And if you're in a situation where you have pain, uh, just it's really light, obviously, you just take it out and get on-demand therapy. So check it out, it's the 5 LED torch, highly versatile instrument with its five different wavelengths. This instrument can treat pain, injury, swelling, lacerations, dermatological conditions, ear pain, uh, sinus pain, ocular pain, and tooth pain. If you're interested in finding out more about it, just click the button in the upper right corner. Well, that's it for today. See you next time.